Good. Hi, Ross here from Fin Chaser Marine in Hamilton. We've had some customers ask us how to add data onto their Ray Marine and also how to change units, e.g. feet from meters. So I'm going to run you through a couple of simple steps on the Ray Marine Axiom series of sounders. First of all, on the home screen, the data that we're putting needs to be added to each of the screens you're going to use, whether it's a split screen or a full. So for this example, we'll hit chart. We'll come up here to the menu setting. We'll go into settings and we'll go into page settings and up comes edit data overlays. We touch that and add. That brings up the menu of all the different data that you can put on your screens. So you can have any of these. So we're going to go for speed. And we, the speed that most people in New Zealand are wanting speed through water. And here it is here. Once you get this data and any of the data, you can then put that anywhere you want on the screen and save it in a convenient place. And if by touching it, you can also resize it to larger or smaller. That's a personal preference. We'll leave it on large for this example. And then you can add another one like depth, because that's always nice to have. And then you put that wherever you want it on the screen. When you're finished, and I think you can have four per screen, when you're finished, you push done. The next little trick to get your units correct, because we're in metric, most of the time people want meters over here, is you'd come down on your home screen to the settings button, and it says units. And then for speed, we see speed units, you've got knots, miles per hour, or kilometers per hour. So some people like miles per hour, some like kilometers, and some like knots. Knots is the supposed correct thing for at sea. So we'll do that. We'll hit the knots. And depth units, we normally deal with meters. So that's done. When you're finished, you can just exit out of there. And that will be set. So when we go back in here, we should be on knots and we should be in meters for depth. You can also put engine voltage, which is the voltage at the screen and many other lots of data. Hope that helps. Cheers.